Hello guys, welcome back to Chris Polly channel. This video I want to share about the fastest way to finish season plus server. Okay, to enjoy watch my video, make sure you turn on this video subtitle and also you can use timestamp that I already provide to go to target topic that you want. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on bell notification to get any update and guide on Black Desert World. Okay, let's start this video content using any feature that I provide. Okay, this season plus server start at 5 15 September 2021 for PC version and if you play on console version you can start to play season plus server start at 13 October 2021 and any new content info from this season plus server you can check on my previous video but because this video I also cover about summer season 2021 ending you just skip this part by using video timestamp that I already provide on this video okay for this season plus server same as another server you just need to create new character but be noticed if you didn't sure what character that you want to create you can access trial character on this character selection menu and you can try any class skill on battle arena using this trial mode okay for this season plus server i will play as timer why i choose this timer because i never play timer class and i want to learn about her skill because i think timer is unique with her pet hey liang okay just create this seasonal character and make sure you check this checkbox to create character as seasonal character and check the name if you see this name unavailable you just need to change its name to another name and if already available, you just need to press create season character button and confirm it. Okay, just change to seasonal server and then just enter with new seasonal character. And then just watch this intro if you never watch it. And just skip it if you already watched it before. Okay, arrive at in-game at forest seclusion. Because this is seasonal character, as always, seasonal character cannot use any normal gear. Seasonal character only can use any gear that you get from main quest. And season exclusive gear like Tufala gear. But because you just start to play seasonal character, you cannot get season 2 Vala gear and you can use this gear that you get from main quest either for defense gear accessory and weapon for weapon I usually prepare black abyssal weapon box that you get from main quest and you can enhance it using obsidian alloy to make your black abyssal weapon to become obsidian abyssal weapon and for sub weapon you can prepare sandstorm sub weapon that you also get this item from main quest from your previous character but if you new player you don't worry about this gear by completing main quest you will graduate Dually get your gear and because you play seasonal character your seasonal character also will gear up with Tufala gear so you don't need to worry about your gear for your seasonal character okay continue with my seasonal character usually I just level up my seasonal character by doing mind quest until more than level 7 because more than level 7 you can start to use table feature for your character and be notice your seasonal character only can use any horse start at tier 8 and below you cannot use any tier 9 horse as you can see if you try to use any tier 9 horse this error message will appear season character cannot ride on a mount and also your seasonal character cannot ride any tier 10 horse so maximum tier horse that you can use is tier 8 for your seasonal character and the reason I get my horse this is to faster my progress when playing seasonal character either doing quest or go to grinding zone to boost my seasonal character level and usually before I do main quest for my seasonal character I level it up until level 56 or until 58 to make sure I can do main quest more faster by killing monster when my seasonal character reach higher level and more detail info guide to power leveling your seasonal character actually I already show it on my old video when Preabyss start to release seasonal server at summer season 2020 actually on this video you just need to seek help to another player to level it up your seasonal character until level 56 or until 58 at any grinding zone and as you can see I just try to go to Fadus area to level up my seasonal character and don't forget after you reach level 49 you need to finish some special quest from black spirit and use this clear memory piece to progress your character to level 50 actually this is confirmation you agree your character can involve to any pvp content and after you use this item and report it to black spirit you can continue to level up your character endlessly okay after reach level 58 i always continue my main quest until the sets of Felia for seasonal character and when you talk with alustin npc at Felia city he will offer you crossword to choose normal main quest or simplify main quest that I already show you on my previous video about skip main quest guide but actually in this video this is old method to do this skip main quest but mostly all info on this video still same and you only can do this skip main quest on your seasonal character if you previously already do normal main quest using another character so if you new player and never do main quest using your account with any other character because
because this is your first character, this crossword will not appear. You just need to do main quest as normal and cannot do this skip main quest. Okay, in my case, I will choose this crossword simplify main quest to skip this main quest and then just talk to Fugar NPC to get the reward and continue this main quest to get this special growth following in his footstep and then just talk to Black Spirit to take continue skip main quest special growth Fugar Memorandum Chapter 1 and just click chat on Black Spirit and say I have complete special growth Chapter 1 objective and do continuous quest from Black Spirit for Chapter 2 and just talk again to Black Spirit to skip this main quest until Chapter 11 and after you finishing this skip main quest you will get all reward from this main quest nearly same as you doing main quest manually and you can start to enhance your Naru gear to become pen and exchange it to Fugar NPC to get pre Tufala gear and more detail to get this Tufala gear and enhance your seasonal Tufala gear to become pen on this season plus server you can check on my previous video because at this season plus server per abyss just give new enhancement rate to make your enhancing process to become pen more easy than previous seasonal server and then continue for your season plus accessory you can enhance your Tufala accessory to become pen by following this guide for your file stack reference and any tips and trick when you enhancing your Tufala accessory to get maximum AP to 148 for main weapon or 250 for awakening weapon and also 312 DP for your seasonal character if you already complete all content that I mentioned on this video and other than enhancing your Tufala gear to become pen as always for seasonal character you need to finish this season pass and finish all challenge that provide on this season pass and to finish challenge from this black desert season pass you need to level up your seasonal character and also doing main quest either normal or via skip main quest to get any reward that they provide and also you can unlock additional reward by purchasing black spirit pass from press shop but this is optional you don't need to purchase this black spirit pass to progress on your seasonal character but if you new player and this is your first character on black desert world i recommend you to purchase this black spirit pass if you have budget to spending on this game because by spending this amount of per you will get reward that more value than this per value and you can make this purchase as investment for your progression for your black desert account in future okay to finish this black desert season pass you can do some content in random order but you need to claim it in order you cannot claim next reward if you never claim previous reward like defeating 1000 monster challenge you only can do this challenge when you reach this challenge because if you didn't reach this challenge yet this 1000 count monster will not appear when you killing monster and also for some challenge like completing book of margahan actually this is family content that you only can do it once per family and if you never do this book of margahan you can check my previous video about guide to aggress favor volume 1 and volume 2 as always I already provide all this related video in this video description you can check it for more detail and another family content that you need to do that you only can do it one per family is doing family quest to get fairy mysterious companion quest line and to finish this quest just open your quest menu and go to suggested tab and you will find this adventure support fairy mysterious companion there are five quests that you need to do from this quest line you just need to follow this quest line actually this is easy quest line that you can do it yourself and next about legendary blacksmith you also can access this quest line from your suggested tab and just scroll down you will find this level 51 media legendary blacksmith there are 13 quests that you need to do for this quest line and you only can do it once per family and next is magical field nether belt quest this is family quest to unlock your nether belt on your black spirit same as before you can access it from your suggested tab and go to level 58 nether band there are three quests from this quest line that you need to do and another family quest that you need to do is sakatu hide and treasure by completing level 60 back of star quest line and for more detail about this quest line you can check on my previous video about family inventory quest line guide in this video i show you some detail info to finish this quest line because there are some puzzle and any info that you need to solve by yourself on this puzzle you can check it for more detail and the last family quest is to complete invitation from i actually this is prerequisite quest to unlock attraction dungeon that i show you more detail about this invitation from i quest line on this video you can check it for more detail to finish this quest line and next to reach level 61 you can level up your seasonal character by grinding or just by doing quests on black desert world either valencia main quest 1 and 2 to reach level 59 because if your character have below than level 59 if you doing valencia main quest your character will get huge hp from this main quest but be noticed before you do this main quest for valencia 1 and valencia 2 to reach level 59 i recommend you to get this 
this Chenga Serkan Tomb of Wisdom that you can get this Chenga Serkan Tomb of Wisdom by completing quest at Saga Stetep, level 53, the adventure storm regarding the legend of Chenga. There are 22 quests that you need to do to get this Chenga Crystal of Wisdom that you can simple alchemy this item with normal adventure tomb that you get from Black Spirit. Because when you wear this Chenga Serkan Tomb of Wisdom, you will get additional combat XP plus 30% from any quest reward, either main quest or side quest. And as you can see, when my seasonal character hits level 58 and have 18% for its level, when I finish this Valencia main quest, as you can see, my character get around more than 1% by completing its quest from this Valencia main quest, either Valencia main quest 1 and Valencia main quest 2. But be noticed, this Valencia main quest 1 and Valencia main quest 2 only will give you huge combat experience until your character reach level 59. Because after your character reach level 59, combat XP that you get from this Valencia main quest 1 and Valencia main quest 2 will reduce significantly and not worth to do this Valencia main quest anymore. And the last reason to do this Valencia main quest, especially Valencia main quest 1, to get this advice of all that you can get it by finishing this Valencia main quest 1 until the end that you can get this advice of work plus 50 and if you already reach level 59 you can skip this Valencia 2 main quest because this Valencia 2 main quest very annoying to do and will consume your character energy so much by finishing this quest line but if you never do this Valencia main quest 2 I still recommend you to do this Valencia main quest 2 at first time to unlock any content on Valencia region if you never do this quest line with any other character in your family because you use new account and then from level 59 to level 61 you can do side quest at Calpeon region especially at Carpeon Northern Western Outpost Outpost Supply Port and Brelin Farm you just need to go to this three area and find any side quest on this area but be noticed make sure you turn on this quest filter to make sure you can see any side quest that offer by NPC on this area for example as you can see my character have level 59 and still have 2% right now and if I finish one of any side quest from this area as you can see it's of side quest that you finish from this area will give you around more than 1% if you use this Chenga Serkan Tomb of Wisdom. But be noticed by completing side quest on this area, some side quest will need you to kill some monster at Star End area. I didn't recommend you to try to kill monster at this Star End area, but you can seek help with another player that grinding at this area to do this side quest. But this is optional, you can skip this combat side quest and just do any side quest that just talking with any NPC on this area. And after you finish any side quest at this area, you just need to move to Kama Sylvia region, starting at this Kama Sylvia Vignity, Lemoria Guard Post, and continue finishing side quest at Fifth Floreta Hamlet, because side quest at this area will give you huge combat experience. And then continue to Old Tree Wisdom and Shady Tree Forest to finish any side quest at these two area. Actually, you can go to Navaran Step, Mansion Forest, Mirumok Ruin, and Tooth Fairy Cabin to get another side quest that will give you huge HP until level 61 but all of this area is combat side quest so this is optional you don't need to do this side quest because this side quest will take you longer time than another easy side quest that you can finish it just by talking with some NPC but if you want to do easy combat side quest you can go to Winnie Cabin and Lonely Cabin at my forest Poly Forest to do some combat side quest that you need to kill any monster at my forest that have lower recommended AP and the last side quest that you can do at Grana City and meet NPC that standing at this area near this bridge. As you can see, this is the NPC that located at this area on map. You just need to talk with this NPC to start this side quest line to level up your character until level 61. And if all these side quests from this Kama Sylvia region still not enough to level up your character until level 61, you can continue to Drikhan area, start at this Ahib conflict zone. And from this Ahib conflict zone, you can go to this Marka outpost to get another side quest. And also this Gayak altar and another side quest at this Drikhan area you can find it at this night crawl post at this area you can find some NPC that will offer you some side quest and you can finish it some of them by talking with another NPC and another part of the side quest you need to kill some monster at this blood love settlement but be noticed below this night crawl post at this area on map near Marak farm you also can find some NPC that will offer you some side quest to level up your character and another side quest you can find it at the Sriya ruin that located 
located around this area, some NPC at this tertiary ruin will give you side quests that you can use it to level up your character. And the last at Sarkar Necropolis area, at this node manager, NPC Kamira will give you some side quests to level up your character. Okay, I think that's all. Any location for side quests on Black Desert World to level up your character until level 61. And actually at some node on Drikhan area, you can find some NPC that will give you another side quest. But mostly if you finish all side quests that I already mentioned before, you already have your character reach level 61. And back to our purpose to finish this Black Desert Season Pass. That to finish this Black Desert Season Pass, you need your seasonal character reach level 61 to finish this challenge Apex Adventures. And after you finish this challenge and claim this reward, you will auto-complete this honorary Crow Merchant Guild member. That to finish it, you just need to finish this Season Pass and claim this Crow Merchant Guild Contribution Certificate 1. And Season Crow Merchant Guild Contribution Certificate 2 if you activate your Black Spirit Pass. And you can use this item to get special quest from Fugar, Season Plus Season Pass Crow Merchant Guild Gift, and Season Plus Black Spirit Pass Crow Merchant Guild Gift. And if you take these two quests, you just need to hand over the Season Crow Merchant Guild Contribution Certificate 1 or 2 to Fugar NPC to get this reward RNG Box, Item Collection Increase Scroll for 60 minutes, and Advice of Fog plus 20 to help you enhance your Tufala Gear until 10. And after you finish your Black Desert Season Pass for this Season Plus, and also already enhance your Tufala Gear to become 10, all of them until accessory. As I mentioned on my previous video about info for Season Plus Server, for PC version, you just need to wait until 29 September 2021 to get additional update to exchange all type of your pen to Fala gear to become special Ted Boss gear that you can enhance all of them to become pen with new enhancement method that they say have steady effort but be noticed to enhance it to become pen they never say this is free or guarantee so there are some process to get this pen boss gear and also at 29 September 2021 they will release more support from growth pass this is post graduation challenge that you can finish it after doing early graduation process from your seasonal character and they will provide more reward by completing this growth pass and this is unlike black desert season pass that you have option to purchase black spirit pass from this growth pass this is free from purchase so you don't need to spend some pearl to get maximum benefit from this reward by completing this growth pass so make sure you enhance your tufala gear all of them to become pen to get maximum benefit from this season plus and if you still need so much tufala enhancement item like time field blackstone refined magical blackstone or tufala ore you can do weekly attraction dungeon especially for your seasonal character that you get weekly quest from fugar npc because if you finish this attraction dungeon for seasonal character to get this falmakea rift chest if you open this chest you will get a lot to follow enhancement material either to follow accessory rift of echo time field blackstone 200 pieces to follow or 30 pieces refined magical blackstone 30 pieces season rift of throne 5 pieces and advice of rock either 30 and 20 and you can do this attraction questline every week from fugar and another source for this Tufala enhancement material you can get it from instant quest at any grinding zone that you can find it instantly on your screen as you can see if you success to finish this quest by killing some monster at this grinding area you just need to receive this reward and mostly this instant quest have two part that first part you need to kill 250 monster and the second part you need to kill 500 monster you can find this instant quest to get to Fala enhancement material at any valencia grinding zone like centaur kadri basilis Basim, Waragones, Desert Naga, Gahas Bandit Lair, Sulfur Mine, Pilaku Gel, Fogan Area at Titium Valley, and Crescent Area. And also for Kama Sylvia Region, you can find it at Manshaum, Mirumok, Fadus, Ronaros, My Forest, Navaran Step, and Givin Rasia Temple. And also you can find this instant quest at Duvenkrun Area, at Drikhan Area, especially at Sarkan Necropolis, Broadwolf Settlement, and Tsria Ruin. And another source for this Tufala Enhancement Material, you can get it by some code that we just confirm some code that you can get 200 pieces time field blackstone from this code and if you join my official discord server you can access this code update channel and this new video channel to get any video update and code update on black desert 
network from any region server. So make sure you join my official Discord server. You also can ask anything about Black Desert World directly to me on this chit chat channel. Okay, I think that's all that I can share based on my experience playing this season plus server from PC version. And special thanks to all my membership for direct support via Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. And also my current member, Zekru, Dubiadut, Jimmy Snack, Doki, Transester, Aganim Scepter, Rene Gets X, Licky Cleaners, Aegis to Guild from NA Server, Gospel, Homi, Ayrton, Suna, Tepan Gaming, Killsteel, King Denmark, Wemi, Cloudy, Puff as Gold Member, and also all my Silver and Bronze Member. Thank you so much for all your direct support. This will make Chris Poly channel running and growing more faster. If you want to support me directly, I will very grateful. And as special thanks, I will put your name on my video, depend on your support level. And be noticed for some level there are have some limit, so make sure you didn't get run out for this limited space and I will put your name on every subsequent video that I release for the duration of your support and if you want to join my membership to support me directly you can go to any platform for patreon karekarsa and YouTube membership I already put link for this membership on this video description or you can check on top right of this video I already put card for patreon link okay guys that's all my journey to finish this season plus server hope you also can follow to finish this season plus server as far as as you can if you like this video you can like and subscribe to my channel for another guide and update thank you for watching see you next time